So this video is about why you need to wear or to buy a pair of red shoes, or not as the case may be. So picture this, I'm at the 2012 Olympic Games in London. I'm uh, walking down through the streets. I'm over there with a group of athletes um, on duty, so to speak. And I'm walking down this kind of high street in London and I walk past a shop and I see the coolest pair of red shoes that you can imagine. And as I walk past them, I look at them and I have a kind of a, a response and then an instantaneous response on top of that. The, the response is like, wow, they're cool. Then I have a, oh my God, they'd be so cool to wear. And then instantly replaced by, God, what would people think? Or will people make fun of you? Or I can't wear those and so on and so forth. But if I just pause the story there for one second and I go back, what's really important about these red shoes for me and why when I get on stage anywhere in the world, I typically wear either those red shoes or a pair of red shoes and they anchor me in a sense of confidence and knowing and value. And it goes back to when I was working with these Olympic athletes in advance, the belief they had in not just me and the work that we did together, they invited me over to London. I ended up traveling, traveling over to London. It was one of the big breaks I got at the time when I was starting out in a foreign country where I knew nobody, stepping into coaching, stepping into speaking. And uh, these guys just basically put a value in the work we did. We worked together and then they insisted on me going to London with them. So I stopped that day in that high street. I turned around and I made a declaration to myself. I don't give a shit how much these shoes cost. I don't even care if they fit me. As long as they're not necessarily women's shoes, I was buying those shoes no matter what that day. And I turned around, walked into that store, walked straight up. I said, the red shoes in the window, size nine, 10, whatever it was at the time. And I basically just, I bought them. And they're my kind of go-to when I get on a stage, when I get on stage to do an important talk, I take out a pair of red shoes and they're kind of a physical representation and a grounding for me around knowing that the work I do matters in the world and that it has value, but more importantly, that I have value in the world. So I would encourage you to anchor that thought process, do the work to make sure that that's real in your life, but anchor it with physical items in your life. Or at the very least, find the equivalent of your red shoes, an item that you can put on, an item that you can wear, not to impress anybody that people probably don't even know about. I've never really shared that story other than people within our community. But I share the story not to impress you, but to impress upon you the importance of anchoring yourself and finding something. It could be red shoes for you. It could be yellow shoes. It could be pink shoes. But it's an item that says, I don't give a fuck what you think. This is about me. This is for me. And it'll allow me to be a better human in the world. So if you want to stay connected and stay part of the conversation, go to our website, philipmckernan.com, and put your email address in, and we'll send you some really cool activities you can do at home and a little ebook around Soul Set, which is our whole philosophy and also subscribe to YouTube. Take care, bye.